Jamison from Josefina Sienna. Josefina was the first American Girl doll that I got in 2006 and Sienna is the first art generational that got me back into collecting in 2000. I am officially now 28 years old. My mom drew, drove all the way from Nevada to Washington to celebrate and I'm on spring break so tomorrow's gonna be um, the Friday of my spring break and it already flew by so quickly. I had a few things for my birthday and I don't want to come off as bragging. I am very thankful for all of these items and I know that gifts are not the main part of birthdays. And so I just spent it with my family, my mom, brother, and sister, and I'm content with that because ultimately like it was years since we even had that. We haven't had that since 2019 due to the global pandemic. So that meant a lot to me. I wanted to share what my brother and sister got before, and it's not, it can be dollar related a little bit, but it is a Kronken backpack. They went on this together and it's purple. Purple's like one of my favorite gifts. Now, the reason I said can be doll related, so it's rainproof and I have my laptop in here because being in the Pacific Northwest, it rains a lot, but you can fit American Girl dolls in here. And this is Ruthie. My mom got the shoes and made the dress. We didn't have Velcro for the sleeves, so my mom told me to grab a doll. This is Ruthie. She bought me a Ruthie years and years and years ago. I believe Ruthie is now 13 years old. So this is the dress she made and I love it. I personally love it. Um, she said there was no Velcro. We didn't have Velcro for the sleeves, but I think my personal preference, because it should be like this, but I think my personal preference is I like it without the Velcro because it was so much easier to get on. But she also got me a loot of shoes that I'm gonna show you. But you can put an American Girl doll in here. You can put an American Girl doll in here and it has zippers on both sides. So you can zip it up like this and they're in the Kraken. So if you, I know they have a few bags from American Girl, but if those are out of your price range, but you also need a bag for school, this is like two birds and one stone. So I appreciate this, it's rainproof and this is a reflective. So I am so happy and excited for that. And then I showed you Ruthie. She is like gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous queen. Like, look, I still have to like show you. I love the fabric because they're limes with the yellow. And so that's mainly why I um, got back into doll collecting. I wanted to like design fashion. And that's one thing I've been neglecting is just fashion design. And my mom and my grandma are avid quilters, so. And then she bought the shoes in a set. And so I added these. I know it's like dark because it's like nine o'clock at night, but I like the yellow that goes with the dress. I also got some birthday money. I should be saving it, but knowing me, here is her old outfit that Ruthie was wearing prior to that. I thought my mom made it, but it was my grandma. But we're gonna try, hopefully tomorrow, to learn how to make this because this top is super cute. So this was her previous outfit. She's been in this literally since I got her. I feel so bad for Ruthie because I got her and then weeks later I just fell out of it just because life got busy. And then this bundle set, which I'm just gonna put the bag on the side. And first off, my mom asked me what I wanted for my birthday. I wanted the My Life As Hello Kitty. 
She stopped by multiple Walmarts and couldn't find them. But these were the first shoes in the bundle. And I was just like, hey, we can go and get Hello Kitty license fabric and just make our own because I think this is the closest that she could get to Hello Kitty. If it will show. But yeah, I was just like, hey, I didn't get the My Life As, but I got high top Converse that are similar to Hello Kitty. So, there's these. And she wants to make more doll clothes together, so I'm super excited about that. Maybe I'll get better and maybe make some videos, but these are super cute. Then it came with a whole bunch of socks. There is so much in here. So it came with blue socks, pink socks, navy blue socks, and gray socks. Like, I need shoes and socks for my dolls because I am running low. So the fact that she thought of these. And then roller skates. And they work. Like, literally work. She said they're from Amazon, but I'm just like, hey, you're saving money from not doing American Girl. And these are so cute. So we got some skates. There's more. There's a lot more. And then there are some. I can't even open these. These are glitter. You can only see the bottoms. So I'm going to try to open it up each bag. I know some glitter is a hit or miss with some people, but there are some glitter flats. There are the sandals. And usually I get the My Life As section shoes, so I feel like even these are a step up and not just chunky plastic. There are these. I am so excited for these. They remind me of like Taylor Swift a little bit. I think the one that looks like Taylor Swift, which I don't remember the number, but it's the one that has really curly blonde hair, comes with the pink gladiators. And then speaking of gladiators, there's a pair of those in here. I was debating between the black these and Ruthie's shoes that she currently has on. And I'm excited for these, but I was just not in the mood to mess with the zipper. So it comes with a zipper on the back. But these, oh my goodness. I think I like these more than the ones that AG has just because they're black and black goes with Then there's more. It's like a never ending pile of shoes. Like I was just like, oh, I got two pairs of shoes. Okay. And she's like, there's more, there's more. Oh my goodness. Like she, I don't know how much she paid for these, but these feel like good quality. Like not the best quality, but if this all came in a bundle, oh my goodness. So these are cute. These are so cute. We're gonna have to do like an American show girl or just dolls. But I keep saying American girl, but my channel is more than just American girl. We need to do a fashion show. And then maybe 
one of the video ideas is comparing if these shoes fit on all the different doll brands. Purple. So these are like one of my favorites too. Oops. Um, it came stained with glue, but we can fix it. We can rub it off. But these are sneakers that are purple with hearts. But it came with glue. But we can polish. We can be shoe polishers like back in the day. These are the only ones with like gunk on them. The others were fine. So I think for only having one pair with like stuff on it, that's still a good deal. So these, super cute. I need to learn how to make doll shoes too, but I think that's the hardest part. And that's everything. Um, I forgot to show these. These I pulled out and I was like, oh my gosh, Skechers. So they are definitely Skechers for American Girl. Like, does this not remind you of Skechers? And like the track. These are like so adorable. And I have a My Life As outfit that has the same exact pink, but it doesn't come with shoes because My Life As doesn't come with shoes. But thank you guys for watching. I don't want to come across as bragging or boasting. I am super thankful for what I've been given and spending time with family. I know a lot of people would wish to spend time with family on their birthday as well as not work. I had my birthday on spring break and I know a lot of people work on their birthdays. So I just feel like super grateful that I didn't have to do anything that I didn't really want to do. Like I didn't have to work. I didn't have to be in school. I think next year I will be in school most likely, but I feel super grateful that I got to sleep in. Uh, super grateful I got to wake up the next today. And so, yeah, I think it's just been a super chill birthday, but ultimately the gifts are not the most important thing. It is spending time with friends and family. And I got a lot of texts and video calls from friends and family. So honestly, like, I think those just triumph. Um, even these I got to have lunch out and about with my family and so it's just the times because we are so limited on time that as much as this channel is like doll collecting and everything um just the concept of spending time with your loved ones spending time how you want to on your birthday or just like even doing some you self-care time really does mean a lot. So I know I do a lot of hauls, I do a lot of unboxings and everything, but this comes as sec second nature to ultimately. Like, I think we only, a lot of people, we only see one side of them through the screen and not outside of the screen, but I don't really buy a lot of doll stuff. It's just every time I do, I post a video of it and it seems like I do a lot of it. But I appreciate you guys watching. Have a great day. And I hope to see you guys next time. Bye.